Big Mama's back in action for some yakking. Guys, we need to find out what's going on. What's going on? Everyone's turning into a meatball. Here's what's happening. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to break down the modern world for everybody because I know where I have all the answers and my life is perfect. <sighs> Alright. People like animals and plants. We follow the path. We try. We tend to follow the path of least resistance. That means fast food, processed, packaged food. You know, you don't want to chop up your friggin' garlic. You're using garlic powder, if you cook at all. Um, you know, like, YouTube is great. Cause it's, uh, like, you ever notice, like, on, on Google? I mean, this is to demonstrate the absurdity of the herd mentality and how severe the problem is. When you go to a, a search engine, like Google or whatever, I'll click in the box, and all these things pop up. Things I've never searched for, just suggestions. Hey, this is, you ever see like, this is what's trending now. And one of the first things was like a, some, some heart failure of some sort. And I was like, what the fuck is this? People like, that's what they're saying? Oh, you, you need to look up heart failure? Um, they're actually suggesting what you should look for. Like, hey, oh, this is what's trending in, the, in you know, today's searches. You know, Paris Hilton, Kim Kardashian. Prince, of course, you know, Prince died. So, it's weird, man. Life is getting really weird. That The reality of life, which is your family, friends, um, real food, like going outside, doing things with your hands, like learning, like a passion for living has been replaced with like, everyone's getting fat, right? And it's this, you know, instead of just standing, feeling good and standing up, fucking standing tall, everyone's like, like on the phone, like, everyone's got the gut, and like, hey, hey, me. Yeah, like, like this, this mindlessness. Well, let me go on YouTube. <laughs> LOL, uh, let me share this video on Facebook. Oh, LOL. Uh -huh. Hey, like people text me I haven't heard from, I, I don't have their number on my phone anymore, and they're like, hey. I'm like, I'm like, who is this? You know, whatever, and I'm just like, that really as our communication like everything's acronyms abbreviations um, people are, are turning into mindless dipshits and now my thing being music um, here's what has to happen with music I talk a lot about you know some things to practice exercises scales arpeggio sweeping but there's a very simple way to go about becoming a good musician and it simply takes work you have to start at the bottom um, and work your way up. If you want to run a marathon, if you want to run 26 miles, you don't go out and say, you don't go to a running coach of some sort and be like, hey, I want to run a marathon, um, let's run 26 miles today. No, y you might walk a mile, you might be so out of shape, you, 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 you know, you might have to work on your mechanics, your technique, um, but what people do nowadays, they'll research what shoes to buy, research what kind of sports bar and spandex, and they might never run. They'll research all this shit. Go into the gym, they might research, oh, should I do, should I do fucking powerlifting? Should I do CrossFit? Should I do this? Should I do calisthenics? Should I do this? I'm researching what workout. And meanwhile, they're not going to the gym. They're not exercising. You know, what diet? Should I be a vegan? This guy says I should be a vegan. Oh, but this guy says I need to eat 250 grams of protein a day. Oh, this guy says I should do the paleo diet. Or oh, this, this, this. Oh, this guy says, this makes sense to me. I can eat whatever I want as long as it's done in moderation. That sounds good to me. So the guy's eating like fucking eggs and French toast and shit for breakfast. Oh, I'm just going to have uh, one piece of French toast. And, and then for lunch, he's having a... Oh, I'm just going to have half the pizza. That's moderate. Anyway, people are no longer based in reality. They want quick entertainment. They want quick results. And what are they getting quick results on? What would they getting fat faster? They're getting sick faster. They're getting aches and pains faster. They're lonely. All the Facebook shit, whenever you... Whenever someone's like constantly posting shit on Facebook, there are certain things you can do, all right? You can say, like I post on Facebook, you know, I, I'm, you know, I might be uh, cooking some freaking food, you know, cooking some spinach and garlic, and I'll look at my phone and be, you know, check out several times a day. Um, but when you see someone like sharing all these weird videos, like freaking, uh, you know, this is lasagna dropped, wrapped in bacon, and they never cooked a meal in their life. You know, they're always eating McDonald's, and they're sharing all these like, fried recipes, 
sharing pictures of a freaking cat playing the piano, sharing pictures, like, that's fine, you want to do that. But now look at that person. What are they doing in life? What are they passionate about, right? Are they, are they really overweight? Are they like fat? No, so, not that it's wrong to be fat, but now you have, if they are, now you have a fat person hunched over at the computer, eh, LOL, eh, share, share, and doing these weird surveys about like, you know, what color vegetable is your face, you know, who's your celebrity fucking partner, like, it's getting weird, man, it's getting real weird, cut the shit, get back to reality, you know, you want to get good at the guitar, you have to start at the bottom, you have to start, you got, you got to learn your notes, you got to learn your chords, and then build up from there. You want to be a chef, you need to boil water, you need to peel a potato, you need to, you, you know, you need to know how to cut vegetables, you know, you need to know how to cut, get garlic out of the friggin' skin and chop up an onion, you know. You need to know how to make flour, uh, make bread dough or pastry dough, you know, it, it, there, there are ways you build up to get good at things. And people, I, I got a buddy who, who was speaking to, to somebody and her son was getting bored with his guitar lessons. He's nine, nine years old, and he's bored because his teacher's teaching him important shit and not teaching him uh, some system of a down song. Nine years old. You do what your teacher fucking says. You learn to read, you learn the basic chords, all right? It's unbelievable. Get back to reality. Reality, you know, stop chatting on Facebook. Go meet somebody, you know? Get outside. Actually play the guitar. Stop looking on YouTube. Stop watching shit like this. I'm doing this to help. I do these lesson videos to help. I'm not making any money on this shit. I think I make like a dollar a month on YouTube shit. Um, stop researching. The research, it, it blows my mind. Hey, what kind of pickup rings do you use? Oh, can you make that with direct mount pickup? Well, come on, man. Really? This beginner to intermediate guitar player Instead of practicing and just being like, hey man, I want a solid instrument, here's my budget, I want this, they're like, alright, that's it, but, alright, I want those pickup rings. Can you, what, what about the inlay? And it's just, get, it's getting really weird. It's getting like, I, I really feel like someone's grabbing my head and wringing out my brain. Like, I'm just watching this shit and I'm just like, is this really happening? Like, I'm a spectator in this world. You know, I watch people at red lights, that, every red light, 100%. If I'm behind more than two cars, the light turns green and nobody goes. I have to beep, because they're on their phone. 100%. I'm gonna pick my kids up at school soon, guaranteed. Howard Lane, I'm turning left, and they're not gonna go. Get your heads out of your asses. Get back to the real world. 